Hello everyone. Today we'll be discussing pyometra. Pyometra is actually pus accumulation and uh, debris in the uterus of cat and dogs. Today we'll be discussing in cats particularly. Well, the symptoms could be variable. First of all, it should be the high temperature like in this cat you can see 39.6 and uh, they are they will be polyuria polydipsia i mean drinking a lot of water urination a lot and the cat will be lethargic overall weakness and not moving too much you will guess that it's uh, ain't doing right and uh, um, all these like uh, lacking symptoms would lead to the uh, uh, like symptomatics but the particular sign will be discharge but discharge is always not there because it will be only in case of open pyometra but if it's closed pyometra you will not see uh, this particular sign but the previous signs all would be there and in our particular case uh, this there was discharge uh, from the uh, uterus continuous and fresh blood was there but we were uh, suspecting uh, that and then we uh, run our diagnostics and they showed clearly that uh, there was inflammation infection and uh, diagnosis was going there but there was an incidental finding that kidney was also compromised in this patient and uh, it was a kind of complicated case that we have to look after the kidney and uh, the main infection as well uh, as you can see here in ultrasound uh, there is a clear um, uh, pus accumulation discharge in the uterus as shown uh, the both horns are uh, filled so and we treated we started treat it with antibiotics as long as the antibiotics finished it started again then we uh, recommended client to go for the surgery ovarian hysterectomy was performed as you can see here in the uh, uh, surgery room so this is uh, both hands are filled these uh, hands have been removed and uh, after the uh, surgery like it's a routine surgical procedure we do and then it was fine I started to eat doing uh, everything was recovering and back to the normal routine so our uh, conclusion would be that uh, there could be pyometra and there are other differential diagnoses um, as well so you have to be sure uh, and use all your diagnostic tools to rule out thank you very much